Yep, this uh, this one seed has been requested or submitted by Smash Daisuku, so yeah. I can't wait to see what kind of hell we are here in order to go on. How indeed. Anyway, let's -a go. Oh hey, alright, let's put our clothes and let's get to work. At least it's gonna be a seed where I predict that dying is gonna be difficult. Well, I don't think it's gonna be better than yesterday because apparently we're not going into something nice here. Oh hey. An early adopty bomb. Sadly, our uncle was already dead. We only got part of his art. I'll avenge ye! Okay, at the very least, we can buy more bombs. That said, we still don't really have anything concrete to stand on so far. Okay, so trees just give magic. Apparently all tree poles give you the same thing, so... Oh, alright. Come on. Ah! Turn your back on free money, that's what they always say. Yep, we've got enough cash for the bottle and for the bombs. In addition to the chest that we got in the sanctuary where we just stole the funds of the church. Oh well. That said, I'm not hungering that much for a big twin. Okay, they cannot, they cannot always give the same. Okay, that's good to know. Because it seemed like it was really coincidental. Year of the boots! 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 Yeah, but it's just like this is the kind of money where picking it up is gonna delay us by two precious seconds. Here's another big twin and the moon pearl. Okay, moon pearl and a bug. Actually, it's not a mixer, it's a voice modulator that's connected to my mixer. Yay! Alright, we're getting all of the good prices out of the hiding pool really early today.
Hey Lunaris, how you doing? Uh, wait. Is my playlist even on shuffle? What the hell? Nothing but songs of Ri from Rise of the Triad. This is kind of freaking me out. But yeah, I'm doing okay. Hopefully I'm not getting a flu or something. Or maybe I just got a headache because of the fire alarm in the building that just kind of went off this afternoon. Yeah, I don't know how people play Overwatch, quite frankly. It's just the... Uh, the fan base of it is just the most annoying, aggravating thing of all time. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, wow, that, that that village is really full of nothing so far. Yikes. Why buy more bombs? Might as well. There we go. 15 bombs, we're gonna have to use them in order to kill a lot of things, because right now that's all that we can uh, use in order to stand on our feet. Yeah, the other seed I did yesterday did that too. I don't know, generally a bad village generally warrants a bad seed. point since I got almost nothing good it's just uh Yeah just like I don't know I kind of have oh I just dared doing the race track because I was like, since there was nothing at all in the whole village, I was like, maybe there's gonna be something good in the race track by process of elimination, but no. Apart from Moon Pearl and Lamp, there was nothing good. But yeah, just like, I don't know, Team Fortress 2, I kind of remember the community being a whole lot more chill. But then again, they everybody just kind of had their own servers everywhere and there, so there was no big centralized uh, community, but maybe it was for the best. You're less toxic than the one game where everybody is pretty much routinely sending the threats over it. Alright, the search for anything good... Uh, the search for anything good continues on. Yeah, just like, unless you were... Uh, like, the people who wanted to play TF2... Uh, on a pro tier level, yeah, there was almost nothing to get mad about into this game. And by that I just remembered all of the fun times that I had the reading the TF2 thread on something awful, which was full of people that was raging about everything all the goddamn time. Oh my, a red boomerang! Alright, somehow this is the best item I have of this run. Yeah, I, I was not a good spy player, but I... I mean, I was good enough in casual play in order to make people rage a whole bunch, so... I was like, eh. Yeah, it's a weapon loon. Look at that. We are definitely... Uh, 
Okay, for a second, the other next best tier of weapon that I... Uh, ah! Oh, wow, okay. That one heart piece just came out at the best possible time. And generally, I will not go out of my way to pick those up, but man, I needed that one. Alright, I figure... Since we have nothing, let's do the casual thing that we do whenever we have nothing to go by so far, and that is... Hey, you know, let's just go and do the fake flippers. Ah, come on. Okay, there we go. Oh wait, do I do the under bridge or do I check out the waterfall instead? I do have the moon pearl. Alright, just in the likelihood that I get 300 more rupees, then I'm gonna be able to go and investigate Zor. Oh my god. Don't remind me this awful seed where I had to use bombs in order to bomb open another thing. Okay, so it was nothing of actual big value, but eh. It's not the worst thing out here, but yeah, just out of curiosity, I just want to go and check out what's on the ledge. And then I'm probably just gonna go and kill myself. Okay. Now, let's do escape. With bombs and a boomerang, we definitely got the tools in order to clear it. Yep. If you have the moon pearl, you can become Jesus. Because somehow swimming and uh, being a, moon, a, a dark worlder or anything is completely the same. It's like I can't, don't really have a good way in order to check out what's the stun enemy drop because right now I don't really have any weapon. Uh, oh my god! P opening the chest just fucked up the entire sequence. Oh yeah, that's right. I could kill with the cane, but oh boy. And again, I must remember, right now I'm not supposed to have the cane. I'm doing this out of logic. Good thing that I do have an excess bomb or something. Yeah. <laughs> Died again. <laughs> oh, alright, so the stun enemy drop eight bombs. Uh Yeah, you know what? This is way better to do this. Yeah, sewers are very likely. I mean, we can do them. Wow, another bottle! What the hell? Alright. 
time to death warp. It's gonna be faster to get killed by this one guy than to walk all the way back to the entrance. Uh, with that said, I do not have the key, so it still remains a risky move, but could be expected by the seed. After all, I have the lamp, it's not out of logic or anything, so I could be totally expected to do what I'm doing right now. Maybe we'll get a weapon there. Oh my god! <gasps> Alright. Should I just listen to the logic and check out Desert? Either that or should I... I should have just have done what I always do in every run. Yeah, you know what? Let's do what I do every single run. Let's do Eastern first, aka the one dungeon without any kind of prerequisites to enter. Also doing alright, uh, pretends preaching, how you doing? Oh, finally, stuff that can be done, potentially. So, oh yeah, it absolutely did not take us any long in order to finally get our winter coat. I don't know, that's just the way that the red mail looks on the sprite. Yeah, it opened up. Look, it opens up that mountain, but all that it gives me is two items on it. What the old man has, and the item inside Spectacle Rock. Yay, one of the two validation rupees in the game. Yeah, right now I'm kind of starting to see your point about this being a pretty bad seed so far. No, because you need Titan Smith in order to have uh, access to Super Bunny Cave. Also, no, I never played the uh, Secret of Mana 2. But checking out the escape is faster, so that's why I kind of do still uh, privily. Uh, ah. ah, come on. All right, chances of getting three items out of this dungeon is seeming less and less likely. Oh, flippers! 
So now, br so now Hobo Guy has unlocked too. Come on, give me something good in order to wrap all of this up. I'm just wondering now, even if I got the bow here, will I even be able to clear the dungeon? Because I have, like, no freaking arrows. Alright, back end of escape, and then I guess... Either desert or that mountain, but I'm kind of... Kind of tempted to do desert first. I do have at least three items here that I can get. And maybe more if I get a weapon there. I kind of have a bad feeling about this. I'm tempted to just immediately uh, turn over the shroom, just in the likelihood that it might be the key to everything. Right, in the meantime, let's get more bombs. we get oh my god my feelings were totally right okay so now let's go and check out is eastern mandatory oh it actually isn't and neither is hero but hey at least now i do have a weapon a weapon with very limited ammo but hey that's a weapon nonetheless I mean, okay, I only have one arrow, so it's not as if it's gonna be a, a big weapon or anything, but at least I can fight. Ah, that said, I forgot to check out Oh my god. Uh, where am I going? Oh my god. bomb okay that's right because this enemy in the regular game i think it drops blue rupees and then if you get it to drop enough stuff then it becomes like a, a red rupee or something i kind of forgot how the price book works Okay, 50 bucks. 
can't really say I'm too concerned about getting money anymore. I've got almost all the money that I need to beat the game. It was a big 300 or something I would have bothered, but right now, yeah. Alright, I probably should lift some butts in order to try and find arrows. Right now it's kind of my life good. Oh, 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 oh. Alright, more arrows. figure out if this dungeon be completed. No, the key was completely worthless. So this dungeon is bootlock. And so is all of the other items behind it. So do I even go anywhere now? Ah, might as well go and check out these spots. All right. So that mountain it is. Yeah, the desert shelf was just a big 50. Uh, actually, yeah, you know what? Alright. This is gonna be a huge waste of time, but at this point, before I go and waste even more time on that mountain, let's rule out the possibility of these two things actually locking anything behind. Whenever I play Asshole Seeds, I always gotta think about the longest possible path. First of all, let's check out Hobo. After that, we're gonna Sieg in order to go to Zoro and check out what do we get for her 500 smackers. And if we still get nothing, then that means the key to the entire mystery is all the way up on that mountain. Yep, I knew that I needed to come here. I mean, arrow is likely not required and I still don't have the means to fight Moldorm, but... The seed is still young. Yep, that mountain beacons can get a whole lot more stuff now that we have the mirror, so I'm especially looking forward to it now. Being hurt into the way of uh, whatever useless junk Zoro. Oh, okay. Potentially useful. Was Bumbo.
Anyway, that mountain time. It's now time to check out what do we have available all the way up there. No, this one see this courtesy smash dice a coup. Yeah, the only bad thing, however, with SimCity 3000 music is that this is going to get the the VOD muted. But hey, whatever. Besides, I doubt that a whole lot of people go back in order to check out my randomizer streams because I always feel like this is probably the kind of stream that has the least rewatchability factor or whatever. So hey. First item is a bust, but there's still maybe four more to go. Yeah, unfortunately, I did not have uh, either the time or well the willingness to play a whole lot of new games. So uh, I'm definitely not the person that you'll want to be looking forward to for opinions about top ten or anything. But hey, I can definitely tell for sure how I like Cuphead a whole bunch. Yeah. <laughs> As for me, I'm definitely gonna start taping Montreal Canadian uh, games in order to rewatch them lose. Yeah, <laughs> the Atlantic is really, really sad. Just like, the, the Atlantic is like, it's the Tempo Bay Lightning and a bunch of other teams. I guess the Leafs aren't too bad neither, they've kind of hit a rough stretch, but I think they're currently in the process of getting their problems sorted out. Oh yeah, that's right. It was more you ought to see too. Alright, so what's the hypothetical item here? Okay, nothing. I don't know, I, I like Battlegrounds. I mean, uh, it's definitely not gonna be everyone's cup of tea, but I definitely enjoyed it for what it was. Yeah, I don't really play the game uh, that much myself, but hey, I can definitely it say at the very least there's some good stuff in there. Oh. Alright, at this point I'm just expecting the basement to have something, so yeah, you know what, whatever. Let's just go all the way down. Also, I'm sorry, but you obviously never play the bad rats. Well, it's a crouching in the tub simulator if you want to win, but if you just want to have a fun time, you know, you can just be a freaking jerk ass and just ride bikes everywhere, do a whole bunch of stunts in order to tip yourself uh, over the top and have a head concussion or whatever. Ah, okay, so my gamble uh, was absolutely not worth it. Okay, now it's for the moment of truth. Can you kill these things with the bow, or am I gonna have to use freaking uh, bomb tactics again? Oh no! No! Smash! I hate you! 
Why? <laughs> Why? Ah, uh, oh, no. Okay. So you do not need to bomb them. You just throw pots at two of these guys. Then you fall in a pit and you climb back up. The pots respawn, but not the enemies. Wow, I am so glad that I noticed this. Oh, no, I'm sorry, this song is a little too quiet. Well, maybe this one too, but eventually it's gonna be hearable. Yep, it's that seed all over again. Fuck me. Ah. How am I gonna fight Moldorm? I won't, because I can't. Alright, now with all of that, we can finally go in the dark world. We can go and... Yeah, in fact, Aghanim is now completely out of the window. Unless that we really wanted to have a red rupee or something. Yep, a good old weaponless seed. Hey, okay, the seeds that I enjoy playing the most. <sighs> Hammerless, swordless. The very least I have a bow, but hey, it cannot always help you. So they say that's not by smite, it's my it's by smash Isaku. Oh, blind is also optional. Am I still gonna go in it? You bet. Because so far, all of the dungeons... Uh, uh, oh. Okay, so bow deals... Yeah, bow deals master sword damage on the base. What's the pistol have? Who knows? We'll figure it out if... Uh, we, well, we're gonna figure it out whenever we're gonna go toward... Uh, well, the end of this dungeon, but right now we're definitely not headed there. Not with no way to kill the boss. Oh, what a great first treasure to have. Sorry, but that doesn't work. You cannot use Undertale tactics in this game. The very least, the fun thing with this room is that I think if you don't have a sword, then the Wallmaster do not spawn. So, the very least, I'll have all of the pieces. Oh, oh, okay, never mind. Because I swear the last time there was no enemy that it. Uh, oh, what the f <laughs> oh. Yeah, I swear that one time I went into this room and the wall master just would not spawn, and I don't know what made this to a cure. Oh, thanks. What a peach. No, I cannot use bombos, I don't have a sword. Yeah, actually, you know what? I'm getting a little paranoid. 
I am actually gonna go out of my way in order to check out what's on the pedestal right now. At this point, I'm just gonna play with the entire shit factor into mind. Oh. <laughs> <What> is <laughs> he, <man? laughs> the shitty seed is filling you with determination. Thank you, pretense preaching. Oh, a rupee horde! Hell yeah! Uh, what? Why didn't my phone told me that if I continue, it's gonna call Chuck Norris? What the fuck? iPhone, go to bed, you're drunk. The Master Bank. It's like, I have so many items right now, but without a sword or a hammer, the things that I can do are very limited. Yeah, I guess. It's like, I don't know, for some reason, my phone kind of just enables itself and just decides, like, uh, to call up on Siri or something without any kind of reason. All right, since I'm over here, I might as well check out what's on the... what's on Graveyard Ledge. It's a pretty unorthodox way to approach things, but hey, at this point... Unorthodox seeds call for unorthodox means. Uh, ah! Ah, whatever. Since I have no weapon, I'm gonna take all the bombs that I can carry. Nah, this song is too quiet too. Sorry. Also, technically it is Fallout 1 music, because that was the first game where this song happened. The song plays whenever you approach uh, the followers uh, of the apocalypse hangout. Oh yeah, I forgot I have mitts. I don't know, I'm still kind of paralyzed by the shittiness of this scene so far. But yeah, in Fallout 2, that song was reused for the Enclave. And it was kind of fitting for the occasion, too. Oh my god! Getting anything? Fuck this seed with a rake. I don't want hearts. I want stuff that matters. 
Well, where is sword? Where is anything else? Where's fire rod? Where's hookshot? Where's hammer? Where's flute? Well, almost all of them are sword luck, because how are you gonna fight the bosses with your bare hands? But as we've established, there is no reason to uh, to kill the Harmos. We got all of the items in the in the Eastern Palace, and finally, the pedestal is not required. Yeah. Mine could be beaten with the blue cane. Do I want to do this? Absolutely not. So where's a green pendant? It's Sarah. But right now we don't have any tools in order to hurt it. No, because the shovel means the shovel item, aka the one you use in order to dig up the flute in the regular game. This cave sure is disappointing, oh boy. Wow, the two hype caves fucking sucked, oh my god. Wow! Now you don't need the shovel for the shovel game. All you need is to pay uh, the lady who, uh, who operates the digging game 80 rupees. At this point I'm just expecting, why the fuck not? Let's go fucking Ogwild! Let's go and check out the first ah, treasure ah, of this sea of this one dungeon scene, again. Man, also, thank you, Pen Henning, for the bits. Also, hello, hey, tall man, how you doing? doesn't risk anything gets nothing and at this point I'm just ex I'm just gonna play in order to anticipate all of the possible dick move ah, okay. that was not it <laughs> yeah Batman is also available but I'm gonna finish checking out what I can do of the overworld oh go Uh oh, oh, give me the arrow. Right, is Bombos good for anything? No, nope, it isn't. Also, this one is way worse so far. I mean, any seed that doesn't give you a sword or hammer in the first hour or so is definitely shitty. Well, I can't do anything in Heist Palace at all because how am I gonna get past the first room? 
I don't have a sword, so I can't use bombos in order to kill uh, the frozen thingies. I cannot go to East Mountain, uh, that mountain east. I don't have a hammer or the hook shot. Right, let's finish checking off some stuff in the overworld. Let's check out if Dwarf have anything. Yeah, I checked him out, he has nothing. Before I go to a thief's town, I want a weapon. Uh, oh wait, I should not have started creating my portal that close because... Oh, I, I do because... Hey, how am I gonna get to Bomb Fairy? Uh, not Bomb Fairy, but how am I gonna get to half a magic devil otherwise? got nothing 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 and a whole lot of nothing so if the chest is not uh, the solution then I guess let's pop in into a uh, thief's town I mean I know the routing is absolutely not the best but whenever I play shitty seeds my routing just get all kind of whacked out Okay, and uh, that'll be it for all the cash that I'll need to finish a game. And a shield! Shield, but no sword! shield but guess what I don't have so I don't know which fancy game you've been playing but we're definitely not playing a link to the past that's the music Yeah, I have access, but let's just say this is too far away for my own good right now. I'm gonna take my chances here first. <laughs> yep, I checked Desert Palace. All items are locked behind the boots. Oh my god, I don't want stuff that I can use with a sword, I want a sword! What the fuck, see?
Treasure number two. At this point, I'm just crossing my fingers really, really hard so that I do not have to fight blind because... Still two items to go and at this point, I don't think we're gonna get uh, all of them. I'm absolutely gonna have to risk fighting blind with the cane. Oh. So, it's like fighting him with the cane wouldn't be so bad, but hey, I don't have half magic, so who knows if uh, the fight is even gonna go according to plan. Uh, if Cesperilla have a sword, it would be possible if the hammer was not a sword locked. Yeah, I don't even know. What potions do I have? Ah, okay, I have a blue potion. Okay, never mind. I guess we're fighting blind then. Pendant dungeons were required in this seed. I'm gonna be able to check out my area. Can I bomb blind? Nah, I can't. It's like, I hate wasting a potion just for this. Right, come on, last item, last item. No! So there's still an item a trap deep into uh, the dungeon. Blech. Yeah, why didn't you share the seed to anybody else, uh, Smash Daisaku? Because boy, it sure is a marvel so far. <laughs> Alright, so now time to check out uh, Pyramid, uh, Catfish and uh, Surroundings. Oh yeah, also I forgot to check off the Mushroom. Ah, uh, ah, uh, whoops. <laughs> what? 
At this point, I'm just distraught. Ah, oh, but to be fair, I can't really... Nah, yeah, whatever. Oh. <laughs> Thanks for the bits. <laughs> One hour and we have one dungeon completed so far. I think this might actually be the worst seed I've ever played in my life, so congratulations Smash Daisuku. I don't know how you did it, but you found it. Uh, might as well use that cash in order to buy potions. I don't know, at this point, do I risk pod? I mean, I have the bow, so I could explore parts of it. Just without the hammer, it might be a pain, but whatever. At this point, this is what we're setting ourselves for. Here we go, Palace of Darkness with no hammer. We don't have a sword, we don't have the hammer, and we have the big key. have none of the items that generally give you like a certain like of a quality of life into the randomizer so boy this run is painful to play so far uh oh hold on a bit i have a phone call uh oh
<laughs> All right, and we're back. Now it's time for the music of mysteries. The music that will tell us, are we gonna have something worthwhile over here or not? Also, yes, it was Chuck Norris calling. They are holding my entire family hostage. Time for a key for a key, huh? Well, you're right! Congratulations! Okay, I've seen plenty of run where that one key is actually not a key. It shows that, hey, Pod has a lot of keys in chess, so the probabilities are definitely uh, gonna be something. Also, the Four Swords cannot be in uh, Ganon's Tower because uh, Skull Woods is a crystal, and you need a sword in order to reach Motsulu. So far this dungeon is nothing either. Come on, I have five chances left. <laughs> what oh. a <laughs> 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 Thank you very much for the donation. Yeah, I'm sorry sword, I'm not finding you anywhere. I don't want a bottle! I have four of them right now! <laughs> Fuck! God damn it! Oh, alright, three chests left for us to collect, and we don't have either the map or the compass. I'm sorry, but I don't think we're headed toward a happy ending. The shovel! Oh boy. So now, there's one, two item, okay. So there's still one item left because I can think of three ch <laughs> Oh that's right, why am I continuing? But alright. Progress has been made. But yeah, I haven't scheduled a stream, but there should be one uh, tonight. I'm thinking of finally starting Blood 2. Yeah, now with the fire rod, we can go and actually... Oh my god, I don't think we can even do this anyway. Th this unlocks nothing! Fuck! God damn it! I hate this seed! It unlocks one final item in Skull Woods. Well, a bunch of items. It, it potentially unlocks one item. <laughs> <What a scene. laughs> Hopefully the sword is next. But yeah, thank you for panning for a bit. Oh yeah, we uh, yeah, we can get into Ice Palace, but we sure as hell can clear it. But before I go into and do ice, I am probably gonna pay a visit to uh, Misery Mire.
I don't need a mercenary <laughs> Okay, so Bombos is required. Okay, so Zoro was entirely worth it after all. And Desert Ledge is uh, worthless. There's nothing good there. <laughs> what do I even do now? <sighs> oh yeah, that's why I never visited Catfish, right? Alright, I guess let's go and do uh, Catfish. Either catfish or let's briefly venture into uh, Skull Woods to get the one chest I can now get. I'm tempted to go and check that out. At this point, just like none of the options that I have available are good. Every option sucks. I only have access to one item, but it's gonna be the one item that will totally make and break this run. Alright, come on! This is totally the time! We've got this! No, nope, cannot be the compass! It's gonna be an item! Either an item or a key, come on! Come on! Palace is left, Catfish is left, but first, let's go and change our big key into hopefully the thing that will get us somewhere! <laughs> oh my god, fucking seed of my butthole so far. <laughs> All right, at this point, yeah, why not? I don't care anymore. Boo 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 I'm not doing good. <laughs> I'm crying of pain. <laughs> ah! 
Oh. <laughs> Thank you very much, not everybody is <laughs> Thank you for the bits. Yeah, whenever I'll be playing Blood 2, I'm finally gonna have fun. Yeah, in 2 hours, 38 minutes, I can switch for Blood 2, that is. If I'm still not playing the seed by then, because fuck! <laughs> I wouldn't put it past the game anymore. <laughs> oh, <What a laughs> yeah, did you find the swords in my tower? <laughs> Thank you very much, Kevin. <laughs> ah, no! Fuck! <laughs> I hate having no lethal weapon. Now, if this was a key sanity, I would have found some items. Even still, then. Thank you. <laughs> what a oh my scene, god! <laughs> oh my god! Also, thank you, not everybody. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I don't know. It's not a mother's lament because. If it was a mother, the the mo the sound that the mother of the seed will do is <laughs> I enjoy watching you die inside. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. The randomizer algorithm for this thing definitely loves uh, Rise of the Triad a whole bunch. Penguins? Nah, I can't. Boomerang just deals damage to them. I honestly don't know what's left after that. There's honestly nothing. Well, there's no reason for me to finish East Turn because I got all the item there and uh, it's a pendant dungeon, so there's no reason for me to do it. Uh. Get out of my way! <laughs> So how far did I get into uh, Blood 2? I 
I got like to the airship level and that's where I stopped because I got like to a point where there was nothing but hit scan enemies everywhere and the game just stopped giving uh, health pickups altogether. Yeah, 82 minutes with no hammer and with no sword neither. Yep, and no hook shot neither. This is the sea that's given in the boo boo the boo the boo 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 boo. Also, thank you, Tom and Wiz, for the bits. <laughs> Oh, that's right, I can't even go down here! What the fuck? What the fuck? What do I have to do at this point? I don't know what's left. There's nothing left. I'm sorry, but that map is uh, clearly just leading to a bar stop in hell. No! No! Also, no, I'm not getting the spoiler log. We're not giving up! We are not giving up! At the very least, I just want to be able to stand proud and say, I solved this shit heap on my own. And this is what we're doing today! Right, this is your last chance, Seed. Your last chance to not be a fucking uh, dickbag dictator. What did I check? I have no clue at this point. There we go! The fucking hammer! Just like that one other time, but now I had to go fetch it with no weapons. And fuck you. Oh yeah, that's right. Also, I can't even come back anymore, so... Oh my god, now if I want to check out the rest of the dungeon, guess what we have to do? Just like at this point, I'm just wondering, is it even worth it to do this? like the game just gave me the item out of order. I would have loved getting the hammer before I went into the down floor because without hookshot there's no way of me to come back. Now at the very least, travels around the dark world are gonna be a whole lot smoother. And another Rise of the Triad song? What the fuck? There's not that many songs in the playlist. There's not that many songs in Rise of the Triad, yet it's hitting all of them. I have to start buying lottery tickets because with these odds I feel like I should. Uh, that's right. I, theoretically, I could kill uh, 
cold stare with the hammer, so alright. Let's pull it all on it. Uh, I don't think so, and if he could be killed by a bomb, then boy, am I not gonna be the one that will make it happen. But now with the hammer, we can finally go to east side the Death Mountain. One hour and a half in! That's all the treasure. Just gonna make sure, doubly sure. Yep, that's all the treasure. Cold stair is probably just gonna give a key. Well, they wouldn't really go down fast to the bow. I mean, the bow, I'm pretty sure, just deals like Master Sword damage to them, so you probably still will need at least 5 or 6 arrows Berlin more. for the ultimate test of skill. Can we kill Cold Stare with the hammer and no fire roll? I mean, at the very least, I do have to We're off a good start. my healing potion yet. Alright, and that's how we go. And that's how we do it. Finally, our first crystal. One hour and a half in. Holy shit. Wow. I hate this. I fucking hate this with a passion.
Yep, I can use kill it with the bow. It's like I was building this dramatic uh, stingy in order to be like, okay, that's how you have to do it. Okay. So I'm gonna immediately launch the cape over here in the likelihood that something bad happens. Okay, I should be okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I just want to die in my own vomit right it now. Looks like you've uh, oh. <laughs> Thank you, Darko, for the subscription. <laughs> oh my god. The seed is the seed that keeps on giving. Happy New Year's weekend. Let's celebrate by enjoying some self inflicted rando V27. Well, it was not uh, self-inflicted, I, I mean... Uh, yeah, no, you're right, you're entirely right. God. Now, I want to go up here because I want to finish Eros Tower in order to check out is there anything of value behind the green pendant. Yeah, it's smash inflicted. Oh, apparently the seed is random. I don't know, just like... I'm not sure I can actually submit this seed to Smite, because I don't hate Smite enough to make him play this garbage heap. It's like, even the seed he made me play the other time was nothing compared to this. He won't. I, I guarantee you he's not gonna fare any better at this. Oh, alright, the real hell seed begins here! Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba the hall of despair where you fall two floors down instead of one. How hootful it is. So I don't think that Diabetes will play this seed. As far as I know, he's not playing the randomizer anymore. Right, only one hit. That's a good thing with the hammer. Old Orm dies really, really fast. And what a great treasure to come back home to. Oh yeah, that's right. Also, I probably should mark off the crystal. I am really waiting for them like to have a feature so that whenever you pick up a crystal, it tells you what crystal you obtain. That will be definitely awesome. Alright, finally, after many tribulations, we are there. Alright, what's up there? Okay, plus five arrows. Yeah, we're boot locked in the desert, and there's two items uh, locked behind it. Yeah, whenever I'll be going back to uh, to Palace of Darkness, which is probably gonna be the next move I'll do, because that seems like the next logical step. We've gotten everything except kill the boss.
Right, come on, now it's time for a good old mountain cave. Please be worthwhile. Uh, I think Blue Pendant was Eastern. At least all medallion problems are forever locked or solved. And apart from that, it's still had nothing. Oh my god, I hate you, see. Uh, oh, that's right. I can just drop down the hole afterwards. I'm not going back up here. It was just a fucking bunny cave after. I've clearly established I don't want any more money. We've got all the money we need in order to beat the next two seeds. I waited so long in order to get here, and so far it's not yielding me any answer. You know what, I'm sending the seed to Smite. I'm not the only one who shall suffer. But hey, the good news with having all three medallions, I don't need to go check out Turtle Rock, because this is already solved. <laughs> Come on. I was right there. Fucking jelly. Oh my god. My fucking god. Floating Island just had five plus five arrows. It's like all that I want is a sword. Is it hard to have a sword? But hey, at least the good news, we can finally do swamp. Well, I probably should do this before I do... Uh, before I do pod. At this point, there's no reason to delete this dungeon any further. At this point I am hoping that the blind chest is not required because it's kind of a long way down here. No, he's talking about the chest in the basement of blind. The one that you need the hammer in order to get. Yep, still no sword. An hour 42 in! Nothing! <laughs> Also, thank what you, good, scene, man. Thank, good to Dak for the bits. Thank you very much. Misery loves company. It's here today, and it'll come tomorrow.
Also, no, the sword is not on the pedestal. What's on the pedestal is 300 rupees. Or 100, or something like that. Okay. It's a lot of cash. Oh, <laughs> it takes in Divin. It's still better than the sword I don't have right now. could have given me like I don't know freaking silver arrows to compensate for the fact that I don't have anything or whatever but no this is the uncle Scrooge Grinch mother of abomination Christmas of seeds oh yeah just out of curiosity what was your time on this Ah, come on. Two hours twenty? How? How did you do this? Absolutely nothing to work with. We almost got all the items in the game, but somehow we're missing almost all of the crucial ones that will ensure that the. <gasps> ah, yes! Oh my god! Oh my god! Yes! 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 Finally, I have a shitty ass sword! Yes! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god! Alright, breathe! Breathe! Oh my god! Well, the, the last time I felt this way was whenever probate that gave me $10,000. Oh my. Oh my god! Oh, oh my god! Thank you for the donation! Oh, thank you, bless the sword. Thank you, everybody. Scene, My Please. God, I, I I love you all. Holy shit! <sighs> I feel better now. How about you? So do we have everything? We almost have everything. Okay, and here's the last item. Uh, oh no, that's not the last item. There's still one more. Because there's two chests. <laughs> yeah, we still need the boots in order to finish the seed. 
and get the two items that are locked behind it in uh, the other place. Yep, you need the Master Sword at the very least in order to kill Ganon. Unless that you play swordless mode, in which case you are gonna have... Uh... Ah, that's okay. The, the more clips of it there is, the merrier. Now we can also go and do uh, Mire, but oh boy, it's gonna be fun to fight a Vitreous with just the Vanilla Bow and the Hammer. I'm sorry, but I'm doing, uh, well, you know, I'm gonna do this uh, other dungeon over there first. Also, no, I'm not doing Turtle Rock with the Hammer, my god. Yeah, we need the boots yet. Go mode is not obtained until we get boots. Nope, we didn't. We're about to do that right now. but it's 51 of them. Yeah, it's technically green, it's just there's 50 of them. Yep, there is. But let's just say how I'm gonna hope that uh, it's not gonna come into play like ever. the sword was in Swamp Palace, where the big key normally is. 
Oh man, you had to walk away from this masterpiece of a sea. So man, that was a master stroke of a hammer hit. Is there still one item? Nope, there's not. doesn't work on it. Hey! Alright. Leader Helbis said, Nine, thanks for coming to the stream. Alright, finally we have three crystals! Five and seven. There's still one item in Skull Woods as well. Oh. What <laughs> Thanks for the donation. <laughs> I wonder if there's like some sort of database that just chronicles all of the names that people have given to the stream. At this point, I'm pretty sure that of all fictional characters, uh, Sergeant Killy is the one that has offered the most donation. <laughs> And followed very closely by Duke Nukem. Absolutely not time, uh, time economic or something, but I want to keep as much magic as possible for the fight against uh, Motsuro. to give money as soon as a slut just fell out of my ass. Wait, did I hit it twice somehow? Or did I hit it no time? Pretty sure it's like one of the only Dark World bosses that- <gasps> Yes! Yes! The boots! The fucking boots! Yes! Alright, only a only Heist Rod remains! Yeah, 
I'm finished as in, boy, I am finished with this season. Oh, wait, where am I going? I don't know. I just feel the urge to travel across long distances. Oh, oh God. Excuse me, that is gross. Alright, do I risk it? I feel like I gotta take the risk. Ah, no, let's not take any risk. Ah, uh, oh, let's take the risk. Whatever. Don't for Well, fork you, buddy. Whenever I actually take the wrong turn every time. But I don't drink. Even all of the booze in the world will never convince me to start drinking. Right. Hopefully, we came back down here for a good reason. Yes, we did! Oh, yeah. All of a sudden, the prospect of going to. Uh, uh, oh, shit, that's right. Ah! Yeah, the prospect of going back to uh, Thieves Town completely paid off. Because remember, I got that hammer only in Heist Palace. And you can be sure I would not have went back down here without a good reason. Okay. Oh, alright, and Bomb Fairy can be done. This time, let's not forget about her. Like I did like a moron the other time that we played. From uh, Hotline Miami soundtrack, an all-star assortment of good songs. No, lying coldly, not lying city. A 
also know this song is from uh, Miles Edgeworth uh, Investigation. Shield at long last. Uh, woo, 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 woo. Ah. I'm willing to bet that basement is required. Or I could chance it and go without. Maybe the final item is on Vitreus. Well, what did you want him to call it? Oh God. I hope that mighty number nine is just buried under a pile of his own shit where he belongs. Uh, oops. Ah, that's right. With that said, I can skip some pain in the Item. Okay, there we go. My is done. Yeah, <laughs> how's this seat going? Oh boy. Yep, thank you, Smash Isaku for it. Boy, it's been an adventure. So only two crystals left. So what's what's missing? Oh yeah. That's right. There's this place which is missing, which can we, which. Yeah. One thing that we can finally do. It took forever for this dungeon to be available, but now we can do it. Yeah, 
I, I got a sword like maybe 20 minutes ago, just in order to give you an idea of how badly the Cedars went. Okay, first item is a bust. Well, honestly, I can't really rant about Mighty Number no. 9 because, to be fair, I never expected it to be anything other than complete crap, but. Well, it's just not a very good game. Oh, 1 hour 46. I'm sorry, but quitting is not part of my vocabulary. And I don't say that because I have no vocabulary whatsoever. Oh god. I I'm so sorry to hear that I carry water here. I am so sorry. Yikes. Ah! Yeah, we'll never know uh, It's like MC need to get his freaking backer number back so that we can finally make fun of him. I mean, I could probably have an idea about... Probably could have an I maybe an, I an idea of who he was if I rewatched the uh, the credits, but fuck it, <laughs> we're not. I'm not watching that ever again. What the hell? <gasps> yeah, I barely watched them because hey. When the credits of uh, Mighty Number no. 9 were happening, uh, I decided to stick true to my word because I s said to him, see, if he finished Mighty Number no. 9, I will do a f second lap of Fiesto. So naturally, as soon as he finished, as soon as he finished, I did start uh, a new scene and I think I called the character Fuck MC or something. A generous backer! Okay, this time uh, Bomb Fairy was not the solution. Alright. Now we can sleep quietly knowing that... Uh, no, I cannot sleep quietly because there are still two things that should be checked. Yeah, Killer MC is a cool guy. Just because he donated money to Mighty Number no. 9 doesn't make him a bad person. Yeah, Bomb Fairy. Yeah, Bomb Fairy. That's our new name. <laughs> ah, come on.
Okay, all right, turtle rock time. I'm fairly positive we've checked literally every place in the world, so now there's only one possible place to go, and it is the turtle. Backhand of escape was done a long, long time ago. So Quake was completely worthless. So yeah, if you want to see more of uh, Killer MC's antics on uh, Dr. Mario, you definitely should check out on his channel. He did end up replay the game afterwards in order to give Dr. Mario a second shot, and it's every bit as good as you'd expect it to be. There we go, Ice Rod, go mode! Already. With that said, I'm gonna fully investigate the dungeon because after all that we went through, I believe we have earned ourselves a nice and quiet Ag uh, Ganon fight. Let's try and find a red sword and the silver arrows too. This song is from uh, Binding of Isaac, the Flash One.
Oh, mirror shield. All right, so uh, we can check out the uh, laser bridge for free now. Well, mirror shield is useful for a laser hallway, and it can help out uh, a little bit here and there in uh, Ganon's tower. Alright, <laughs> goodbye pretense preachings, thanks for coming to the stream. Magic! What a timely find. Fair release is gonna make the Trinex fight completely trivial. I could do it with the Master Sword if I wanted to. Items. It's all we're missing now is one sword, and yeah, that's about it. And the silver arrows. Two hours and a half, and we finally have all crystals. Yikes. Alright, so what do we get out of this? Uh, oh my god!
I have never seen that happen. Objection! Your seat sucks! journey but we're finally here Seven bit is still on. Oh, seven! Lucky seven! Alright, okay, I'm gonna take a random guess and let's just go into uh, the DM room, as the spoiler notes call it. <laughs> to come home empty-handed. I want the silvers. Uh, oh my god! So I have to fight a cannon with the freaking spin attacks two seeds in it. I've gone and passed this. Definitely coming home empty headed or empty handed. Oh well. Jeez, are the silver arrows even in this fucking tower to begin with? Where could they be? But hey, at the very least, now you're having a disclaimer on why skipping the silver arrows is entirely worth it if you have the equipment necessary in order to win. Because boy, you're losing a lot of time. Nope, we went to Mimic Cave.
Our first sword was deep in Swan Palace. How empty this entire seat have been, I'm really surprised that there's absolutely nothing in Ganon's tower neither. So is it just gonna be like a freaking validation uh, silver arrow somehow? I have lots of fairies. Alright, thank you, Dan. Dan, uh, thanks for coming to the stream. Ah, that's right. I don't have silver arrows. I'm too weak to kill these things and only one hit. Freaking Beemos. Oh, 
All right, finally we have butter in order to put on our toast. Okay, so I got butter, but I still don't have silvers, however, so where the hell were they? Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck you, Seed. Fuck you. Oh my god. This is just stupid, my god. it ended well. Like a fairy tale. to have midnight snacks, then why is there a light in the fridge? <laughs> the dangerous kitchen. Find the arrows in my validation chest. <laughs> right, come on. Ah. It looks like you just <laughs> Thank you, wicked them beats for the sub. <laughs> This Ganon kill is for you! And time on what is literally the worst seed I've ever played in my entire lifetime. My god. Whee! I'm sorry, but that was the very last thing that was on my mind as I was, uh going on with this seed. Whee! What? And now Siri just turned itself <laughs> on again. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Thank you, Smash Isaac. <laughs> Thank you very much for the huge donation. <laughs> My god. Yeah, at least not three hours. 
No, not every seed is the worst. I'm sorry, but the seed I did last time, I only did bad because I fucked up and failed to check out, uh, you know, Bomb Fairy. But this seed was unredeemable. There was no factor of this seed that could make you think, ah, that was actually okay. No, this entire seed was a shit fist from the beginning to the end. <sighs> yeah, we only miss a couple of pendant and a few hearts, but then again it was my fault because I decided to fully investigate Ganon's tower because I wanted the silver arrows. Just like, if this seed was a pedestal, how could we have made it even worse? Yep, 238. Welcome to the oh, Witch and Robin Hood. <laughs> okay, I love the the witch having the bow message. <laughs> but yeah, 238. That was not a pedestal seed, and that was not an Aghanim seed neither. Well, to be fair, I think that Validation Silver is killed even more if you decide to do like I did in that one run and fully investigate Ganon's tower. I mean, otherwise I definitely wouldn't mind it because, hey, that will be the, like the one part where I will have the Silver Arrows for sure, but... Ugh. Quiver enlarging kid. But you see, what he actually enlarges is not well your bow capacity, it, it enlarges your ability to quiver at how bad that seed was. <laughs> <laughs> but man, th that seed was definitely a big emotional roller coaster. You cannot say that the seed leaves people indifferent. Then, whenever you finally go and triumph, then holy shit, you feel like a king. And the groupie horde sleeps again forever. But yeah, where were silvers? Validation chest! The very last chest you get to open in the game. I told you to never come back here! Now, I've got something to say to you. Do you like hurting people? If not, I recommend you upgrade to version 27. That is all that I have to say. Well, I leave you with two predictions. This will be your last randomizer for 2017. Then you will be back in order to suffer even more. Yeah, we're gonna check out our chest count. It's gonna suck. 191! <laughs> I got... I was only missing one chest. <gasps> My god. Missing the final item in Eastern, which was nothing. I never went into Haganim's tower, so that was two less, two, ch two less chests. It's called Town. We missed the chest because I knew there was nothing in it. Misery Meyer, same. Like 26 out of 27. 
What did I miss in Ganon's Tower? I mean, I swear that I got everything. Suffering. Who likes suffering? Not me. Who likes it? Everybody else! Yay! Oh. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, Toro 47, you definitely have missed one hell of a run. That was hands down the worst seed I've ever seen in my entire history of doing randomizer seeds for Link to the Past. It's just, man, it made you work in order to get every little hint of progress. Whew. But yeah, enough about that. Let's see, is there anybody else who is actually streaming uh, Link to the Past right now? 